don't remember much. The only thing I remember is running into the vault. Oh my gosh, look at baby Peng! Yes, when the dance moves. Little Peng Peng was like, peace! Oh, we've got all the stuffed animals today! Beamon, my bear, he has no name. Slashy, and a new addition, King Penguin. Oh yeah. Oh fam, you're never too old for stuffed animals. Penguins, my name is Peng, and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a very special video because da, 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 tomorrow is my birthday. Oh my gosh, I love my birthday. I'll just put it out there. I love my birthday because you get like the birthday week, the birthday month. Oh, I milk it. As some of you may know, I've been back home in Canada and it's actually been really fun. I love home cooked meals. I have been going through old pictures, old videos, and today I thought it was going to be extremely fun to watch my very first competition ever. Yeah, this is when I first started competing. Little backstory, I did gymnastics when I started when I was four and then when I was seven I actually quit because I hated it so much. I hated gymnastics because all we were doing was conditioning and I heard we were going to be doing flips and stuff and there was zero flipping. So I think when you were younger it was just more about the developmental stage. We didn't really progress as fast as I wanted to and I really just wanted to jump around and play but I just remember holding those hollow holds and here, little Peng Peng was like, peace. Anyway, so I quit when I was seven, came back when I was eight, and joined this gym club called Richmond Hill Gymnastics Club under the coach Michelle Arsenal, who I absolutely adored when I was younger. My mom asked me if I wanted to try it again, and I said, only if it was for fun. So we went into the gym, and it was a smaller gym. Mind you, I think there was a pole in the middle of the floor, if I remember. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there was a pole in the middle of the floor. Just training there, their motto was to have fun, and I had so much fun. I was learning new skills, I was getting my routines, and I believe in Canada when you're eight years old is when you start competing. I could be wrong on those facts. I started competing when I was eight years old, and I absolutely loved competing. I think just because it's fun to put on a little leotard and then also fun to get your floor routine, get your beam routine, and do some dance stuff. I don't remember much at all from my very first meet. The only thing I remember is running into the vault and I'm pretty sure my dad got it on tape and so I'm so excited to watch it with you guys because oh my gosh I don't know little Peng Peng I don't even know what I look like like it's gonna be super interesting so I thought this would be a fun birthday activity to do on my YouTube channel so if you like this video press the like button also don't forget to comment below what you think about my gymnastics when I was younger and make sure you guys subscribe to my channel so you can become part of the penguin family. Also, before we get started, I want to make note that this was before the Peng Peng days. Like, I would, did not compete as Peng Peng yet. This was Christine Lee, and so everything here is Christine, Christine. It's like, that's my first name. That's actually my real name. Peng Peng is just a name that I used when I got older because, you know, I kinda want it to be like uh, Hannah Montana where it's like, Christine by day, Peng Peng by Jim. So it's just a cute stage name that I used and it's also, it definitely caught on so it was nice because people started remembering who I was. Yeah, this is totally before Peng started. I do remember from my first competition that my form was awful. I think I watched this a couple years back but I have not watched it since. I had to put it onto a DVD. This was on the old camcorder. I don't even know if you know what it looks like but it's the old camcorder that had to fade in and out to start recording because it had to warm itself up. So we finally put all those camcorder videos onto DVD. When I uploaded it to my computer, it wasn't even in the format compatible to my laptop. So I had to convert everything onto my laptop. So you can see how old this was. This was, my first competition was in 2002. Some of you weren't even born yet. Yeah, that's a long time ago. I need to hold a bear with me. I don't know, I feel more comforted when the bear is in my hands. Oh my gosh, look at baby Pei! So cute, wait, pause, I gotta pause it. Look at me, I'm so cheeky, just peeking out the side, but do I look the same? I don't know if you can really tell because it's kind of blurry, but look at my little baby cheeks, oh my god. This is little eight-year-old me. I don't even know how tall he was. Peepin! Ooh, see the fade in? Oh, look at me, my little leotard. Guess this is when velvet was in fashion, and velvet leotards were totally a thing. 
I come because he doesn't get to warm up. Wait, ro rewind there for a second. I love my dad's commentating in all these videos, so try to pay attention to what he's saying because he always commentated as I was doing gymnastics, so it was really funny. Oh my god, my head just touches my elbows. Oh yeah, 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 you get it, you get it. Okay, okay, look at that handstand. Go over, go over. Yay! I think that was warm up. Oh, look at my little red bag! I'm dead. <laughs> Wait, we need, to, we need to rewind to that. I'm dead. I really punched the ground. Okay, I'm pretty sure I ran into the wall. I know I ran into the wall. Here I go, here I go. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> And fade out. I just remember hitting it, being so winded, my coach asking me if I still wanted to compete, and I'm like, yes, of course I still want to compete. But I mean, no, I was considering not competing. Oh, there we go. Oh, and I fell. She just asked to do another one? Wait a second. Was that my competition vault? I'm not 100% sure what was going on. See, gymnastics in Canada, I don't know. I don't even know if that was my competition vault. Oh, I might have been warming up one more time because I ran into the vault. Look how nice all the Canadians are. Oh, that was good. That was so cute. All right, not, not even thinking, just going. Just run and run and run. Can we? Oh, that was good, that was good. Can we um, pause? and take a note that it was the old vault that I was competing on. There was no tongue. I think the year after this is when I competed with the new vault. I'm pretty sure. But I wanted to make note that I still competed on the old equipment. So yes, I did. I had experience on the old horse. Thank you. All right, I think this is my second vault. Oh, I'm just taking a look and look around. Just go in. I oh, didn't really carefree there. Yay! Oh, forgot to present. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting because I, I also think I did a lot of things out of the rules in this meet. But okay, let's check out my bar routine here. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys, I just it's so cute to watch this. This is so crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh those knees though, those oh yes, yes. Switch kit. Okay. Oh, that was a nice hip circle. And a long pause. <laughs> Oh, cute. Oh, I'm pretty sure I fell. I, I don't know. I, I just, I, I really grinded. I just really wanted to finish my routine, really pushed through it. Oh, cute. That was a good dismount. Just a little strong. Oh, forgot to present. There we go. <laughs> present again. Before we go on to the next event, I remember being really, really young and being so scared to jump from the low bar to the high bar. Because when you are younger, that high bar is really freaking far. Like, it was my goal of the day to catch the high bar just from the low bar. And I remember catching the high bar and pinging off, landing on my back, and literally being like... <laughs> I could not breathe, and I think I had PTSD from jumping to the high bar. But I think I overcame that fear, and finally I grew a little older and could jump to the high bar. But you could see that there was a lot of concentration there when I jumped from the low bar to the high bar. Alright, let's go to B. I loved B when I was younger because I could add dance onto it. Is this Christine's routine? <laughs> My dad goes, is this Christine's routine? <laughs> they have no idea. No one, no one knows what's going on. Aw, oh, look at the little bunny hops. I'm like excited to watch my dance. Oh, I just dove for that front roll. Oh no! Christine just fell off. My dad, Christine just fell off. There, thanks dad. The little dance moves, I love when little kids' arms and elbows are just the same height as their head. It's like their head is so big for their body. Yeah, not bad at dancing. Oh, a little wobble here and there. A little toe walk. Oh yeah, a little staggly. I think that might have been my favorite move back then, was the stag. Yeah, she fell off on <laughs> my the My baby scale. Wait a second. <laughs> I love little kid gymnastics. My baby scale. Well, like, barely, not even split. Like, not even close. I don't even know what really I was going for. 
Just with the dance moves. Okay, this move, okay. Don't forget to present. Don't forget to present. Yeah. There we there we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's that's epic. She's upset because she fell off. Why that again? So funny. It's okay. I'll get over it. Oh, this is what I did for. Oh look, I'm visualizing already as a young kid. Start oh I just back up. I just popped off the line. Oh, that's what I remember from this. Floor was a struggle because I didn't know any rules. Again, forgot to present. I'm pretty sure I stepped out of the line and I'm about to watch this and see if I actually stepped out of the line. Like I danced out of the line because I didn't know you had to stay in the line. Well, I guess we'll see. Oh, that's a good back tuck. Oh, that was so cute. I'm like, eh, I don't care. <laughs> I'll just go for it. She goes, are you nervous? I'm like, nah, whatever. <laughs> the day is when I didn't get nervous. I'm pretty sure I wasn't nervous at all. Oh, wrong spot. Okay, oh, look at the smile. Oh, I remember this routine. And then it hopped, hopped. Oh, I was early. <laughs> See, I, I just went out of the line. <laughs> and I'm offline again. Oh my god, <laughs> this is so bad. Oh, that was nice. That was really good. I remember getting this 14 and I loved learning the choreography. Oh, little shift there. Oh my god, the smile. Yes. Oh, little side jump! Oh my gosh, so cute! There we go. Oh, oh, oh! I like almost fell on my head there. I totally remember this routine. And a kick. And a jump. Yeah. I'm so fast. Oh my gosh. Oh, not done yet. And then hop. Yo, 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 yo. Cute! Oh my gosh, so cute. I'm, I'm saying cute so many times. I'm sorry, guys. She didn't hold the um, finish long enough. My dad, she didn't hold the finish long enough. Oh my gosh. Now you can see if I look the same. It's closer video. There's my club, Richmond Hill Gymnastics Club. Oh, every team had their own presentation. That girl was late. <laughs> oh my gosh! It's like an all blue, even though I ran into it. There you go, Christine. So back then, I also competed as Christine Lee and not Peng Peng. So this is not when the Peng Peng face started. <laughs> I don't even know how I did in all these events. Oh, yeah, y'all. There was only four people in our category, guys. I don't even know what level this is. I think this was level three, but it's different than in the States. So I think this was provincial level three. Third place, Oh, I'm just sweeping up third place, eh? And fourth place, That's cute. That's so funny. Thank you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all laughing in the background. <laughs> I probably came third or last because I kept stepping out of the line. <laughs> the judges were probably having a field day being like, did dot, did dot. Oh, yeah! I came third. Oh my gosh, this is precious. Oh my gosh, and that is it. That was my very first competition ever. That was in Canada. Honestly, don't remember. Ow, ah, oh, ow, go away. Honestly, I don't remember where it was at all. I have no I have no idea what gym club that was. I have no idea what area that was. I, do, I don't remember. I really don't remember. It was so fun. I wonder if you guys uh, remember your first competition. Tell me about your first experiences and what you remember. I do remember going out of the lines very clearly and I remember running into the vault. I mean, how can I forget my first competition ever when I ran into 
the vault. After my Florida team, when my coach came up to me after, she was like, you know, next time we have to stay in the lines. She was so great. She just told me I had to stay in the lines because I clearly, I just, I hopped wherever I wanted to. Really didn't know what was going on in my first competition, but I would love to hear your first competition experiences. Maybe if you guys like this video, I'll do another one where I catch you up or other old videos while I'm at home. I have a plethora of old videos from my first national championships, my very first international competition, my first games. We'll have a lot of fun this summer. Penguins, thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching. I hope you guys want to join the Penguin family. You can join me and King Penguin and a bunch of the other penguins out there because we are all family guys. I'm wishing myself a very happy birthday because it is tomorrow. So I really hope you enjoyed that video of when I watched myself when I was younger. Penguins, we'll see you next time.